Hey everybody, James back here again with you. And today I'm bringing you part two of the 300 Blackout 16 inch barrel series. Now, uh, not only did we get a chance to shoot with Double G on the first video, but they sponsored us on the second video here. So I truly want to appreciate Double G uh, Guns and Archery for this video. If it wasn't for them, we wouldn't have been able to do this video. And also, um, I don't know the customer's name, but I was actually lucky enough in this video to use um, another proven platform for the 300 Blackout, which is a bolt action, Ruger American Ranch Rifle. Um, it has a 16 and an 8 inch barrel, I believe. Um, just the Amer it's American chassis, everything about it's the new new style. Um, great rifle. It had a Hawk scope on it, and we were shooting um, the three different types of ammo that we used in the first video which was the Remington Supersonic 120 grain and then we used the Hornady VMAX Black 120 grain then we used the Sig Sauer um, Elite Premium Series I believe but uh, we were shooting at 100 yards to see how well the uh, gun would shoot because the customer wanted to get the gun on paper uh, spe specifically for the Remingtons um, that's what they're going to be using for shooting and hunting and whatever else but they wanted to get the the gun on paper so they left it at the shop for us to do and uh, I was lucky enough to be able to do that to shoot it and get it on film for you guys so um, hope you guys enjoy it Okay, so you notice there that the uh, <clears throat> first three-shot group was with the Remington. And uh, typically, Remington shoots really good just about ev out of every you know gun that we've tested in the 300 Blackout. Um, it was probably about a one-and-a-half-inch group. Um, second group was the Hornady VMAX Black. Um, they were 
about the same as out of every other gun we've tried, about two, two and a half inch group. Nothing to brag about. Um, the last group that I shot was with the Sig Sauer Elite um, 300 blackout ammunition and it was probably the tightest group I've ever shot with that ammunition which is the most expensive and I mean it it's pretty awesome and I think that's the reason why the reason why it shot so well is because the Ruger American Ranch Rifle and 300 Blackout is um, has a barrel twist of 1 and 7 so it's a little bit of a faster twist so it can stabilize um, different shapes and longer and heavier weights of bullets so it can take just about every 300 blackout bullet and shoot it and stabilize it compared to a 1 and 8 and 1 and 9 twist. So that's probably one upside to that. Another thing was we were shooting before a thunderstorm. Um, if you can't tell in the video there was probably about a 30 to 40 mile an hour wind blowing. Um, secondly that gun was still practically brand new. Um, I stayed until the person or a family relative came and picked the gun up from the shop that day after I got done shooting it and come to find out they've only shot a couple rounds through it so the gun was not fully broken in and what I mean by that as we were shooting it and testing it there at the shop gun shop you know we probably weren't getting the rifles full potential because it still hasn't even been seasoned or broken in yet or whatever you want to call it and so after all the the testing with the, the original ammo that the that we tried in the first part of the video the, the first series we reshot with the Remington um, Supersonics again because like I said that's what the customer was going to use for hunting and target practicing whatever for the gun that's what they were going to use because it plus Remington's the, the least expensive 300 blackout on the market as of right now still we reshot with that ammo and surprisingly enough um, I got a group that was probably about a half to three quarter inch uh, three shot group at 100 yards and then uh, the owner of the shop he re he shot it and you know he was almost the same whole accuracy so don't know what happened there maybe the barrel got seasoned enough I don't know but all I can say is it was a, a real fun you know gun to shoot I've never shot a Ruger American platform before. Um, I think that's the first time I ever actually shot a Ruger rifle. Um, I've never shot a Ruger rifle before, so it was a pleasure, and it was really fun. Um, you know, specifically, specifically in the 300 blackout cartridge, and then I was introduced in the Hawk optics. Um, that was a Hawk optic on that. Never shot with a Hawk before. Um, that was a pleasure shooting with that too. Um, you know, a lot of air gun shooters shoot with Hawk, and I do a lot of air gun videos, so they're real famous for that. Um, really clear optics. Um, so, like I said, the gun was a treat to shoot, and I really appreciate that. And I appreciate Double G and for letting us do that so um, if you're in the area and want to stop by and check them out um, they're located in south central Indiana pretty close to me where I live at um, I'll put all their information in the description below so if you're an Indiana resident or an a res, uh, out of state resident that can buy you know firearms or anything like that along the nature or just want to stop by and say hi um, like I said I'll put their information in the description below and uh, a link to their Facebook page because they have deals all the time posted on their Facebook page but I truly want to appreciate them for sponsoring the channel um, they do a lot like I said they they did the first video the first part and they they wanted to do this second part with the Ruger American which was a customer's gun so I I truly appreciate that and um, you know like I said the rifle is a treat to shoot it's really awesome rifle um, fully adjustable trigger I mean like I said you couldn't ask for much more just to have the test for a whole day and it was like I said it was fun and uh, the ammo that we got to test to see you know which one it likes and which one it didn't compared to the AR platforms like I said the AR platform being probably the most common in 300 blackout and then you have your bolt action so again everybody thanks for watching please check out Double G Archery and Guns um, like their Facebook page for me and also check out our Facebook page um, I'd like to get it grown you know get it going and growing if you wouldn't mind so as always guys thanks for watching I truly appreciate it, and we'll catch you on the next video, everybody. See you later.